side. Callaway trying to keep it going. Miller now, three on two. Randall taps it away from behind. Belong to Kentucky. Great hustle that time by Mark Randall as Kevin Pritchard was trying to defend three on one and hustling back. Getting into position, Mark Randall helps break it up. Miller, long three. That was an NBA three-point play. Plus, he's got two buckets, both for Trey, and he has six points. And it's 11-9 Kentucky. And they step up the pressure defense and another turnover against Kansas. Pelfrey down in the corner. Goes inside with it. Feldhaus. And he walked. And Rick Pitino storming the sideline. Well, the intimidating presence of Pekka Markinen in the lane that time really caused the turnover. Hands all over Pitino. First year back out of the NBA. Markin Markinen off the inbound for Mark Randall. Three minutes gone here in the first half. Kentucky leads it by a bucket. Markinen breaks free. Heads up play by Pekka Markinen. You talk about a great pass. That was Kevin Pritchard on that play. Whistle in front of the Kentucky bench. Go back over to Kansas. How about the pace of this ball game? Well, this is to the fans' liking, no question about it. Both yeah. teams getting it up and down the floor in a hurry. Offensive foul against Reggie Hanson. That's his second. Well, they are moving the ball. Markinen has Pritchard ahead. Drops it back to Rick Calloway. 30 on the shot clock for Kansas. Tied at 11. Wildcats in the man defense. Calloway lost the basketball. Hanson with it. Over to Sean Woods. A little stutter step past Calloway. High shot. Woods now with five points. Pritchard drops it off to Callaway. Can't get it to fall. Rebound, Hanson. Reggie's second rebound. Helfrey, long three. Man, these guys can nail those NBA style three pointers. Now, we mentioned the fact that they were averaging nearly 330 three point attempts per ball game. Pritchard. Good feed to Callaway. And Rick, a little too strong. Randall there to put it back up, and a whistle before the shot. Mike Maddox and Terry Brown ready to come into the game for Kansas. It's Kentucky leading by five in this one. But Roy Williams has a trump card in this ball game. It's the fact he's got a little deeper bench than maybe than Rick Patino. Patino only eight scholarship players, and Roy Williams is not afraid to go up nine deep on his bench. The Jayhawks have Missed four inside shots or five out of nine shooting on the afternoon as Mark Randall looks for his first points of the day. He's a 63% shooter. Kansas cleaned up its act down in SMU at the free throw line. All five Kansas starters now have scored. Nehemiah Brady had the rebound and stepped out of bounds on it, so it'll go back over to Kansas and a chance to pick up an extra point this trip up as Adonis Jordan looks to inbound. Miller picks up Terry Brown on the defensive set for Kentucky. Maddox swings it to Adonis. Brown fakes the three, steps up. Well, the mere presence of Terry Brown and his reputation caused Kentucky that time to overplay the 6-2 guard, and he took advantage by stepping up and taking the two-point shot. That was a very smart play by Terry Brown, and the result is a turnover by Ricky Farmer, and we have a timeout. Cards to Kentucky. They lead it by two. 16-14 the score. Four points on the afternoon. It's a 16-14 lead. Kentucky, Kansas basketball going from left to right on your television screen. Adonis Jordan off the inbounds pass. 15-20 to play here, first half. Jordan given some room by Richie Farmer. Terry Brown, long three. 
Well, he didn't hesitate on that shot. He hits 53% of his three-point basket. That'll be traveling on Feldhaus. What well, great defensive support. And we've got a technical call on the Kentucky bench. All right, Rick Pitino tossed his towel out the center court. He's gonna, he's gonna get another one here real quick. That's a second traveling call charged against his club. And that one definitely looked like traveling from our vantage point. The first one may have been questionable. He's all over J.C. Leinbach. Well, we are using Big 8 officials here today. Great defensive support on that play by Terry Brown as he was guarding in the man defense uh, Pelfrey and he slipped off to support defensively in the lane and caused the turnover. Kentucky with five turnovers in this ball game. Kansas with two mechanical errors. Delvin collects them both. And it'll be Kansas basketball. Can be R-rated here in a second from Rick Patino. Gelder needs a little bit more room to get the basketball in. KU with the biggest lead of it has had in this basketball game. Brown trying to drop it in. Randall with the follow. Maddox touched it last. Be Kentucky basketball. 19-16 the score. We're on a pace here to score about 120 points in this ball game. I don't think these teams can keep up this pace. Farmer. Brings it up against the KU man defense. Pelfrey picked up by Terry Brown. Feldhaus, who traveled last time up the floor. Derek Miller hounded by Geldner. 30 on the shot clock. Good cut, good feed, rejected by Maddox and a foul inside. Well, Rick Patino was working the officials a moment ago to get that very call right there, and he got it. So uh, maybe the uh, the trade-off and the technical foul and the two points might be worth it in Kentucky's view. Let's take a look at it again. Great backdoor cut. And uh, there's the foul by Mike Maddox. Maddox didn't think he got him, but the official was right there. He didn't argue too much with it. Fell down at the strike. 73% on the year. Now Freeman West will come in. Pekka Markman ready to check in as well. Randall will go to the bench. And Mike Maddox checks out with the one personal foul. Kansas has been fairly clean. And it's two personal fouls here. The first five and a half minutes. Feldhouse now with three points. Four now for Feldhouse. Kansas leading by a single point, 19-18. Marking it with the basketball in the backcourt. Packard dribbles across. Pritchard. Good ball handling by the 6'10 postman. Gelder looks for three, won't go. Big rebound inside. Miller wants the basketball to the near side. Spin move by Pelfrey inside, a brick. And Pritchard looks up the floor. West to Markinen, one on one inside. Pekka. Oh, what a move by the 6'10 postman, Pekka Markinen. Put that one up off the glass, swinging hook shot with his left hand. Three for three for Markinen. Geldner goes down in the lane. Derek Miller for three and nets it. Miller has nine points on three buckets. He is three for three. He has not missed. Richard will light up for three. In and out and around, and Derek Miller with the rebound. His legs are cut out underneath him and traveling to do the call. And he just slipped. Take a look at it again. On the rebound, Derek Miller Ooh, may have gotten tripped by, by Terry, Terry Brown. Brown now. Rick Pitino was not happy with that particular say, call. Good thing Rick Pitino didn't see that on the replay. Six turnovers now in the game for the Wildcats. Kansas still with just two. Miller checks out. There's Brady back in. 13-26 to play here in the first half. We're not at a 21.